Hey everyone, Zaxcraft here. Today I'm doing a tech tutorial on how to get a muzzle flash on a BB gun. Any size, you can use this or a little pistol. I can't find my pistols, which will be a lot easier. But anyway, what you need is a gun of any type. It can just be a little plastic gun which makes noises. It can be anything. You can use your hand even, like that. Um, so yeah, this is how to get the muzzle flash. First, you need to download a tool called GIMP. GIMP is free and really easy to use, and that's what I'll be using in this piece. You can use other things like Photoshop or anything which uses transparency. So yeah guys, I'm going to go ahead and take some raw footage, which you need. Okay, so you want to take a shot from the side or from the front. Now, you can add other things like a machine gun, but that goes on for a bit longer, so I won't teach you that in this tutorial. So yeah, guys, let's edit it now. Okay, so you've got your raw footage here. Um, what you want to do is get okay, it so, so as soon as I shoot, from the side. You, you pause. So I'll have to go back through a few, fra a few frames for that. Um, so when I begin to shoot here, I'm just going to get up the snipping tool snip that out right there um, yes I want to save, I want to call it tutorial 1 um, you don't have to call it that but that's what I'm calling it open up GIMP uh, GIMP being the free software I told you about in the intro file, open um, tutorial 1 so you want to just double click pictures again, well I do anyway um, tutorial 1, there it is um, open that up, and then what you need is the Stubbs Guns effects, uh, which I have put in the description for you. Extract that with WinRAR, you need that as well. Um, you want to uh, grab this uh, muzzle flash here, you see it? Um, right click, open with GIMP, and then when it's here, you just get this, um, con hold control and hit C. Uh, you can cross that off now, close without saving. Click on here, hold control and press V. And then you've got this. So you want to click this to scale it. Come up with a little box. Make it the size that you like. Um, like that. Hit scale. Hit the little box. Grab it. Bring it here. To flip it, because it's like this, you don't really want it like that. You grab this tool. It says flip tool. Click. Grab that. Cross again. Put it just there. File, export, um, call it the same, replace, and then export. Um, and that's all you need for GIMP. Uh, now what you want to do is here you want to you want to split that where you've taken a screenshot. Go forward until it's the next one, and here delete this, delete that little bit, and then you want to open up tutorial one. Um, wherever it is, there it is. Put it in there. Uh, the duration for this needs to be 0 0.4 or 3. Um, so 0 0.03 I'm going to do just to make it look a bit realistic. So okay, then so you, you can want see to you've take got a nice from the side. Yeah, like that. You've got the nice thing. I'm going to actually make that 0 0.04 just because it's a tiny bit longer. Then what you want is you want to open up your gunshot 2. Um, this is for a single shot. Um, place that there, and then we will watch that. From the side, and there you have it. So if you want a front view as well, you can just add a front view. But I'm not gonna actually have the front view. I'm not gonna teach you that because it's exactly the same. But instead of using the gunshot side, use the gunshot. Uh, no, the muzzle flash um, middle instead, or center, or front, or whatever it's called. So yeah guys, I hope you enjoyed the video, I hope it helped you, and yeah, I'll see you in the next one guys, thanks.